Hey YouTube, today uh, my video is about a uh, Horlock Downrigger Swivel Base. I want to use this on my freighter canoe. Uh, you can use this about uh, on any boat. It's cheap, effective, and most satisfying part, you're going to build this. So, uh, what I'm going to use, I'm going to use a Horlock. I don't have any on my boat, so I'm going to install this on my boat where I want it. Uh, second, I have a uh, steel plate. Uh, I'm a construction guy, so a uh, lot of scrap uh, I see each and every day, so this is coming from job site. What I did is measure the base of uh, quick release. Uh, this one is for uh, Scotty Don Rigger, but you can do uh, it for uh, any uh, brand name uh, Don Rigger. You can do the same. So, did uh, what I did is weld a uh, half inch bolt to the uh, metal plate, drill the hole for the uh, quick release uh, bracket. Okay, I'll go uh, fast forward. I will assemble it uh, with the quick release and show you how it's gonna work. Okay, so you put the washer. I'm using a nylon lock nut. This is gonna be way better if it's locking in place. Okay, now you have your uh, quick release down rigger bracket installed to the plate. Of course, uh, I have uh, choose the wrong uh, length screws. I will to uh, top them with the grinder. Uh, now it's going to work with Horlock, just like this, but. You want more space here, just to be a, a bit higher from the edge of, of the boat. So I'm using a bigger nut for spacer. This is going to be on the boat. You will have to put a washer. You're going to need a lock washer and the nut. Look here. I have a welder so uh, I've made a handle for that nut. And you're gonna secure this to the boat just like that. And you install your down rigger on this. Nice, simple and easy and you can even swivel the base. You're fishing, the boom is out on the water, and if you are not fishing, uh, you want it to maybe put the boom uh, just aligned with the side of the boat or something like this. We just remove the uh, downrigger from the quick release bracket. Uh, if you don't have a welder, there is absolutely no problem just for the purpose of showing you what to do. I did a sample in wood. Cheap tools, scrap plywood, okay? Drill a hole in it for a half inch bolt. Uh, this one is not long enough, but it's just for the purpose of showing you. Drill a half inch hole, put the bolt here you will need of course uh, a spacer uh, after this you're gonna need to put 
a bolt here to secure uh, that bolt to that piece of plywood. Like I said, this one is not long enough, so you will have to uh, adjust the length of that bolt. Uh, you're going to take another piece of plywood with a bigger hole in it. And now that bolt is under that second layer of plywood and you can now mount uh, the uh, quick release down rigger bracket. You drill your holes for the quick release bracket and you continue. Uh, you uh, should see here uh, the bolt and you can do the same. You put your washer, lock washer and your nut. Like I said, if you don't have a welder, no problem. You will put uh, another nut just like this one. You're going to do this and you're going to put your nut here and tighten it with a, a wrench, pliers or whatever you have. That's pretty simple and fast forward. So now I'm going to show you the setup. I have a small aluminum boat in the garage. Uh, watch out. Don't watch, don't watch too much uh, in my garage because it's winter time here and did not have the time to uh, <laughs> clean it up. I've put everything uh, in that boat. So I'm going to show you how it's going to work with the downrigger. Okay, so now uh, this is my aluminum fishing boat, 14 feet, whole Prince Craft. Here's a, has an oarlock socket. So what you need to do is you need to put uh, a spacer, you want it to be uh, a little higher. Of course I'm going to cut these, but for now, uh, just for showing you, I'm going to put the spacer right here. I'm going to put this in the socket, right there. Now, you need to put the washer, the lock washer and after you're gonna screw the nut There you go, nice and secured. Okay, like this, it should work. There you go, clip this there. Adjust your stuff the way you want it. So, here it is. So you can adjust it where you want it. You want to, to retrieve the ball, bring it to the boat, so there you go cheap and easy swivel base now I just need to paint it in black just like the base of the Scotty uh, quick release bracket So if you like what you saw, give it a thumbs up. Maybe you can leave a comment down below. Uh, maybe you can share this uh, with your friends and family. And don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.